Hey guys, what's up? It's my head Lee here again. It is going to be a, a quick video to show you how I record my PC gameplay videos and how I render them and so on. So, to begin, uh, I use Fraps to record the actual gameplay. So, what you have to do is you download that and install it. And when you want to record, you simply open it and you go into movies. Uh, you select a file where you want to save the clips to. I recommend doing it on an external hard drive. Uh, just as frees up a bit of space for the computer. Uh, I, I would recommend setting a, a capture key to record video, something that's not used in the game you're using. So I've done for the number one on the numpad. So once that is done, you select your capture settings. I usually leave it at 60 FPS and full size because this gives you the best quality. Uh, for sound, you just leave this tight, record Windows 7 sound. Uh, that records all the gameplay sound. You can either have stereo or multi-channel. I just leave it at stereo. Uh, you can also record uh, external microphone if you're doing commentary and things like that. So you take that and I'm using a Personas interface for this with a Samsung C01 uh, pencil condenser microphone. So you just take that and you can press a key to record if you want. I just leave that too. Uh, once that is done, uh, you'll notice this little thing up here. This basically shows the FPS of the game you're playing. Uh, it's yellow when you're not recording and when you press record, whichever key you've selected, uh, it turns red, as you can see here. So once you're ready to record, you simply launch the game and press the record button. And once you're done, you press the, the same button again. And once that is done, you can find your video here by going to view movies. And all your videos you've recorded with Fraps will be here. So, we'll minimize that, and next step is you open your video editor. I use Sony Vegas Movie Studio HD. Uh, so, first thing, find the file you want to use. So, let's just pick this one, and you can either drag it in to Sony Vegas or add it by using the insert media buttons. So once that is done, uh, you can do whatever editing you want to the video by adding titles or text over it or uh, doing color correct or stuff like that. Uh, next is project media settings. Uh, for this you match everything to your recording, so I've done it in 1080p. Uh, change it to 60fps or 49, or 59 sorry. Uh, Next, uh, rendering quality, put to best, and leave that, and apply, and OK. So that should be your video now, with a pretty good quality. So, what I usually do next is go to render as. Uh, I use Sony AVC as the output file, and I just use the HD 1080p 60fps uh, template. So, once you've done that, you click render, and that's it. So thanks for watching guys, stay tuned for the next video, thanks.